What's going on you guys, BTIC back again bringing a brand new video and today I have another Pokemon TCGO pack opener for you guys. Uh, before I get into it, let me just tell you I did put an update video which is going to be the previous video to this. Um, that's explaining my whole channel, what's been going on and a schedule that I made. So for any pack opens like this for TCGO, that will always be on Fridays because I will do actual pack openings Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday and I'll use those codes to do my pack open on Friday but if you want to go check it out I'll put the link to it in the description below it just explains everything uh, I think it'll be a li little bit easier for my channel I think it'll be easier for you guys so make sure to go check it out and with that being said let's get into the pack opening today so for today's opening we have quite a few different uh, types of packs we have two ancient origins five breakthroughs one Phantom Forces that was already in here, one Primal Clash, and two Roaring Skies. So hopefully with this amount of packs, we can get something good. So we'll start with the Phantom Forces, just because. So I believe we should have 10 packs, 11 counted in the Phantom Forces. So by the 10 packs, we should get something good. And for the first pack, we get Glyscore. Not the best. Um... But that was a free pack anyway. So on to the real packs. We'll start with Rowan Skies. So hopefully we can get at least one Ultra Rare. Maybe a Full Art. But I'm aiming for one Ultra Rare. And just a bunch of good rares that I can possibly use. So we have a new Reverse. Being Rushing Ram. That's a good one. And for the first Rare is... Salamence. Now Salamence I never really got to use. I don't know, just being like a stage 3, I think it's kind of tough to get to him. I think it's kind of a process. But, so now we have Ancient Tree, Dragonite. This is actually being my favorite Ancient Tree. Um, I have about 3 of them in my collection. But I think this one's really cool to use. It just stinks that he's once again another stage 3. I've tried making decks to get to him. I just can't. I don't know. It, it just takes a while, you have to find the right cards to get to him. Um, and he's also costs a lot of energy for his attacks. But let's see. We have another new reverse, being Azumarill. And for the rare... Starn. So, if we're not going to get anything good out of those packs, it's Ancient Origins and definitely Breakthrough. I'm hoping to get something good out of. So let's try a no look pack. So I hear it opening. Anything good? Anything good yet? Okay, so we have another new reverse. Being Reverse Gyarados. Not bad. And... Don't even want to talk about that one. I'm so sick of seeing Metagross. I'm sick of seeing Metagross. I'm sick of seeing Parasect from Breakthrough. But, there we go. Mega Ampharos. So I knew out of one of these packs, we're about to get something good. So Mega Ampharos, definitely going to come in handy. I believe I have a Mega Ampharos already. I believe I do. So, two will definitely come in handy. But now we're on to Breakthrough. Breakthrough has been interesting with us. I don't think I've gotten too many good cards out of it. Out of Breakthrough, I think I have one Mewtwo EX. And I just recently got the Full Art Mega Mewtwo Y, which I don't even think I've been able to use yet. I don't think I've gotten that far in the game. But Halucha, it's not terrible. What's this attack? This attack isn't... Okay. That's not bad. When an attack isn't affected by resistance, that comes in handy. It only costs two energy to cast or do the attack, so it's not terrible. I still would rather Lucario for the sheer fact that it has three different attacks. But okay, there we go. One card I was definitely looking for. If I was gonna pay a stage three Pokemon or stage two, uh, definitely be a Typhlosion. Because I've been stomped by him in a few games. So he's pretty good. And Typhlosion is definitely my favorite starter out of that region. 
so for this rare Raichu not bad we do have a break for Raichu so maybe we'll see maybe we'll get use out of them I don't know I haven't really made a thunder deck yet so it's Aromatize. Uh, nothing too good. I think this is the last pack here. It is. So, hopefully we can get something out of this pack. Anything good? Nope. So, for the final rare for this pack opening is... That is awesome. Full Art Mewtwo EX. And that's definitely the one that I was looking for. I prefer the red one over the blue one. So, we got a full art, and we also got a mega, which is awesome. I do not believe, he's not the secret, but I'm definitely looking for more Mewtwo's. So, let's see. Let's see if I can find him. I don't even know what his attacks are. So, yeah, I do have two Mega Ampharos, and I do have two... What is it? Regular Ampharos. So that's gonna come in handy. So we have Shatter Shot for 30 times the amount of energy attached to him for Psychic. And Damage Change, switch all damage counter on this Pokemon with those on your opponent's active Pokemon. Not bad at all if he's really low on damage. It will also be a good thing to not use any type of potions or Nurse Joy. So that attack will definitely help. So that's awesome. So I have two Mewtwo EXs now, which is awesome. I have, let's see, it'll be down here. Then I have the Mega, so that's awesome. So maybe I can finally make a deck around them. I have it in the deck right now. But, uh, it's kind of hard to get to it. So, yeah, not that bad of a pack open, if you ask me. 10 packs, well, 11 if you count the Phantom Forces. But, so out of 11 packs, we got two Ultra Rares, one being a Full Art, so it's not bad at all. Can't complain one bit. Um, so yeah, hopefully I can make something good out of those cards and make a good deck. Because Lightning is definitely a powerful deck. You don't really, if you want a powerful Lightning deck, you don't usually put it with another color sometimes just a mono thunder deck is really good um but you, you'll need more you need like minectric and thunderous and more powerful pokemon but lightning by itself can definitely be powerful psychic i would much rather run that with dark energy or i'm not even sure what i'm running with it right now or they might just be Psychic and Dark. I think that's all I have right now. But anyway, if you guys enjoyed the video, please drop a like. Um, I do give out codes. So it's not just me opening packs. I do give out codes as much as I can, depending on how many packs I do open. So like I said before, I did put an update video if you want to check that out. Link in the description. And other than that, I really hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, comment any suggestions you have for me down below, subscribe for more content, and I'll see you guys in the next video.